Hey guys, welcome to my channel. So today I was setting up my music. Okay, so I thought how about if I show you. So let me show you. I don't know what to show. So I'm not going to make a tutorial, but I'm going to explain to you like everything which I'm doing right now. So this is MPD and it's a program. It is going to run in your computer in the background as a daemon. So you can run it as from system D or you can run it manually every time you start your computer and the thing about mpd is it's a really you know old tool if you want something simple there is also something like cmos okay i i'm i used to use cmos but now i'm not using it mpd give you a lot of advantages over cmos because it's a daemon it will run in the background and then you can use any front end client side music player that music player is going to get connect with mpd and it is going to play music so i'm using ncpc ncmp cpp every youtuber have hard time pronouncing it ncmp cp okay so, all right i accidentally all right so this is the client side in curses like it's a terminal based music player and it's going to connect with mpd so the music uh, is going to get played by mpd but this is just a controller like ncmp cpp is just a controller you don't really have to use this tool if you want you can use something like uh, mpc or there are a lot of other options which you can choose from now i am actually using multiple things so i'm using ncmp cpp and i'm also using something like E M M S M S, which is a Emacs, you know, program. So I sometimes when I write program, I just want to play music from my editor and don't really want to open anything else. So yeah. So let's talk about MPD first because this is going to be hard. This is some server which we are going to run on our local host. And but before all of this, all right, you need to have some music in your computer. So download some albums. I have all my music collection here in music directory. So these are the artist names and inside any artist name. So if I go to some artist name, let's try. Okay, this is not artist. I think, yeah, that bit, the Beatles. So inside the artist name, there is a album. Now, in case if you don't listen music like albums and stuff, I would recommend you always go for albums. Don't listen standalone, you know, tracks. Now, some people might say, but why? But, you you know, the artist packaged the album. So you should listen to the entire album. It gives you the feel. Just don't use random shuffling and stuff. But if you want, you can, obviously. There is nothing like, it's just my suggestion. So, yeah. So this is cool. Like, you have an entire collection. I used to download albums. I always listen to albums A to Z, like, complete. So I never shuffle music. So after you have like all the music, now make sure to download music in good, you know. Now I have a really hard time downloading songs. I really don't have one particular place. I download the, I sometimes torrent, but what I'm trying to say is, okay, let's open LF. Okay, I I, I know these days sometimes I use LF. So always make sure to, you know, download in best quality, like 320 kbps. So this is important and then there is one tool which is Picard all right now let me tell you about Picard so there is this thing brains musicbrains.org and this thing is actually collecting all the metadata of you know it's an encyclopedia of all the music metadata now in case if you are not a sucker of metadata well that's weird actually you should like you, i i really care about it so sorry for blinding you but this is the tool so this thing this music brains provide this tool picard which you can download so i downloaded it you have to add the folder of your music and after that you can just select your music you can click on scan it's going to scan for it and on the right side it's just going to show you the album of that song and tell you what songs you have what songs you don't have and it will fix the metadata you can also manually do changes so learn about picard and change the metadata make it perfect all right so once you have like 
you know good quality 320 kbps you know all the albums so uh, you can also download from torrent like for example i just download this album uh, from the torrent so uh, let me show you the torrent okay so the, this is like one torrent so yeah i do torrenting i already told you okay now please don't write comments like you know the artist needs money or something okay so after you you know clear all the you know shitty meta like remove all the there are like website names in the metadata try to remove that make your you know collection perfect so mpd okay so let's talk about installed mpd now it's already installed in the config make a mpd directory and open mpd.conf now here you don't really have to type like all the configurations which you might see in archwiki or somewhere so you can bind the address not really it's just default but you know you can write this is something important the audio output all right so i'm using pipe pipe so i wrote this if you want like something like kava or some visualizer audio visualizer then you can also have another audio output and uh, you know and e let's let's open archwiki of mpd the archwiki so i'll recommend you i don't really go on to make a tutorial about this i i am like i will suggest you to read this so so you can copy this uh, mpd conf example when you install mpd it gives you this file uh, here and it, this file contains comments to explain so let me open this so in case if you want to see uh, all right some people were asking to make slow videos so today i am going very slow so this is like a simple you know configuration you can read what to what and you can uncomment and after you have this it's not going to be a large configuration so just enter uh, whatever the audio output you need and you don't really need much from here okay but always give the music directory all right so make sure whatever the current like music directory is where you have all the all the music just give the path of it after that you will start mpd by clicking and like just typing mpd and if everything is correct it's going to give no output all right so in my case it's already running i'm not going to press enter but once you press enter after typing mpd it's just going to get start if every configuration is like configuration is correct or then it's going to get start you might get it like okay it's re really like if you are new you might face some issues all right that's something i believe uh which happen if you don't really understand things so you can also start system d uh, of mpd so basically there is a demon system d demon which comes uh, the way i'm doing it is this all right so here i have this line so i copied it from archwiki it's there all right let's see okay this is the line so every time i start my computer it's going to start mpd after that when your mpd is running you can install this tool mpc and after that mpc update to update the database sorry all right and database is updated and again now any client like n okay what ncpcp all right so it's just going to show you all the music and you have to learn this client the key bindings and everything and uh, let me show you my emacs emms2 in case if you care then okay so there's the key binding for it so here you can see my collection and i can play any song here <laughs> all right so sorry if i you know if your ears got uh, like hurted so thanks for watching this video and i'll see you in the next video